twisted twisted testicles and I had to go to hospital for you ever it. had that oh man I've had that nine times bullshit nine times Just untwist some butt oh really welcome to episode number 35 of the Mighty Michael Fully Actual Podcast five episodes left everybody and let me tell you we still there's a stubborn few amount of tickets left alright our live show 11th of November Okay, we want to sell out. It'd be very embarrassing if we rocked up and there's like, you know, 40 empty seats or so, whatever we got left. So if you're free in Brisbane, 11th of November, the tickets are $40 each. Come and watch our live show. And then we're going to go out and get drunk together afterwards. There's a bar tab that we're putting on. Okay. Will and Powerfish is going to be there. It's going to be a wild, wild night. Yeah, don't make us look like for clients. Yeah, please. Please, we, we increase the size. Thank God we didn't do up to 500. Man, at one point, we're going to do 3 million. Yeah, we're going to... Considering that getting a venue for 3 million pe- play people, it's added as rock. <laughs> That's never been done. I know. That's why we're like, let's be the first to sell out a 3 million venue. Yeah, we we're going to be on top of Airs Rock, and then everyone's going to be underneath it. And we're just going to sing and dance and shit and do shoeys. <laughs> okay, not as rock, but like something like somewhere that. near it, like Uluru, a big building on it, a big scaffolding, the same size as Uluru, but next to it, so we don't stand on Uluru. A big scaffolding tower next to it. We'll get like a replica, so it's safer. Can we all sing um Happy Birthday the Qantas song together? Happy Birthday! It's Matt's birthday, everybody. Yeah, it's not. Anyway, what shit talk? What's happened on the weekend? Oh man, what uh, look like? Well. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, pretty much, eh? Fucking 15 days sober today, cunt. Fucking feeling good. Having good night's sleeps. More energy, less um, anxiety and depression. Um, losing some weight. I've really let myself go. I don't know if I've talked about this, but man, I've seen some... I had a shirt off in the video the other day and I was just so disgusted. It's hard because, yeah, once you sort of start to go down that path, it's just oh. like you just start treat, 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 then bang! Fat, so fat. But now it's all good. Fucking, fucking getting better. <laughs> 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 nah, it's, we're running heaps. Yeah, we're fucking exercising every day. I'm just going to exercise every fucking day. Can't. And what about you, mate? You had you had your little fly lay over, hey? Um, I went for a walk, a Sunday walk. Who with? I've See, been... Injured. Who is? So I haven't been able to. But that walk's time. okay? Your knees for climbing? A little bit. It's still pretty fucked. But okay. I got the walk out. What are you going to do about that? Are you going to fix it? I'm, I'm doing physio with um, Jimbo's mum. Is it working? Yeah. Oh, that's fuck yeah. So your knee's back to normal pretty much. Not back to normal, but it's, it's slow, slow, slow. Recovery. Is walking okay for it? Well, I did 7K walk. It was fine. Yeah. Oh, fuck it yeah. Didn't hurt too much. It was just tight. That's all. So does it swell up like a balloon? No, not anymore. Does it oh, hurt good. when you twist on it? Little, it feels weird. So no dancing. Yeah, all you know, twist and shake. None of that on um. What about golf? Yeah, I think I can get back to that. I, I don't, I don't think. To, I don't think that you should do that. Yeah, I don't want to do it. I only come so I can hang out with you guys because that's all you guys fucking do now. It's been over two <laughs> weeks since I've played golf, and I'm lies, like, lies, lies, shit. lies. I yeah, saw we play, you. We went to the driving. I saw range. That's you. not golf. Yes, it is. Driving range is just like, that's like, it's okay. It's another yeah. stupid part of golf. Nah. Golf is, you need the real, you need a green and you need the, 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 the nature. I hate and you it. Need it. You need all of that. The, oh, the, the potential to get birdies. Oh, um, fuck you for but, saying that. Hey. That is on the level of fucking stickers. No, no. I feel you. I feel what you're going golf through. Golf is cooler. I than, feel what you're going through. Golf is cooler than recycling, fucking basketball cards, stickers, and movies all put together. Movies, stickers. My one hobby trumps all your hobbies put together. Movies, stickers, and recycling. There are more fans of that than there are golf. Yeah, but they're losers. More fans. No. Nah. Golf. Let us know in the comments, guys. What do you think's cooler? Mm. Golf or stickers? Hang on. I said movies, stickers. Recycling. I can't win against golf with just stickers. Well, team, show me <laughs> golfers out there. I really, really would love to. Um, if I had time, if there was two weeks in one week, I would spend that second week doing a channel, a golf channel. And you Matt should would be do able a to do that now. Channel. What are you joking? It's for clients in the for clients. Just speaking just, of um, it, channels, fucking our J- James has has started filming. He's going to start his own YouTube channel. He's, he's very adventurous, very outdoorsy. So he's just going to yeah. vlog his adventures. He does all these crazy shit, solo adventures. 
And he'll just like point at a mountain and he'll be like sitting down somewhere. Just I'm going to climb like, that. I'm going to climb yeah, that. And without, any, walk. without any equipment, any so safety equipment. He was in Thailand once and he was just having breakfast and he's staring at this mountain and he's like, I'm going to fucking climb that. And he just literally just jumped on his uh, scooter and scooted towards the mountain and got there and tried to climb it. And I think something happened out of the rain and it flooded or something. But he got pretty much up there yeah man he does he does some crazy ass shit and and he hasn't named the channel yet so once we know the channel and he'll film a few episodes yeah. first he's got to edit all the content so it's a little while away but james is going to start his own little fucking adventure channel it's going to be fucking sick too it's very fun and um yeah weekends are um far, far more productive now that not fucked up all the time and just crippled uh, just in a ball of fear death soon but yeah, I agree. It's much. I, I found I went to the gym both days. And yeah, the so did I. It's sort of like that's your new drug. You sort of replace yeah, the bad f- habit with a good habit. It's nothing on a fucking big fat line, but can't. <laughs> oh, and it's no goal. Fuck me. Oh, I took my girlfriend, my new girlfriend, on the Sunday walk. <laughs> that's Ooh. good, girlfriend. <laughs> did she enjoy the walk? Yeah. What did you guys talk about? Lots of things. No, cannot you say oh that? yeah no. sorry i know you're getting it so um i was um uh she asked me how we're going for the like how the, you know what's the live how's it going preparing for the live and i said oh well i haven't done much but um but uh, she, i i thought that was the perfect time to mention because i hadn't told her yet that there's a c- bottle involved mince, it's a mince, <laughs> mince, bottle. It's a mince bottle. bottle sorry kind of bleep bleep <laughs> Um, and yeah, so I decided to mention, um, yeah, the mince bottle. And how'd she take it? Yeah, pretty good. Oh, well, there you go. So <laughs> that, that would be, that would be like a burden having that, knowing that you have to tell someone that because you don't want to give your new girlfriend like the ick and they think, well, that's like, I don't really know this person. Have her oh, think that. Well, here's how it came up. Like, I know, uh, she wasn't like the biggest fan of spitting and saliva, because I think I, I think I said something in my mouth and I spat it out just like that. Thank you, Michael, for doing that. Blow that, Connor. Um, and I was, I was, and she was like, oh, she's like spit kind of freaks me out. Kind of similar to you, the way you do. Yeah. Well, and I'm pretty sure that's just normal, to be honest. I think it's a normal thing. I just, you know, I've just hung around Marty and Michael so much that when I spit, 50% say no and 50% are cool with it. I think it's more like a, like a 95, 5% <laughs> spit. I'm that 5% that's the, for it. I think yeah, spit spit, pardon. And so I I was explaining that I, I sometimes you know pick up spit and be a bit sick. Oh, and you show her. And anyway, um, no, I didn't show her. I just, just said that, and then she was like, "All right, that's a bit weird." And I was like, <laughs> "Okay." And I said, and then I was like, maybe I should mention the cum bottle too, which she was okay with. Um, and yeah. <laughs> if there was a button here right now and you had to press it, and she was bald forever, but you got half a million dollars, would you press it? Half a million. Yeah. Oh, no. What? A mil? Half a, you would definitely yeah, do that, man. A mil, probably. Bald forever. Yeah. Forever. Just and you only get on half a mil. Half a mil won't even last me Just a couple of years. put a wig on her and she would never know that it was you caused it. Yeah, maybe. Wait, am I allowed to get transplants? And then all of a sudden, you're, you're like higher status because she's lowered herself. She's bald now. For a mil. Okay. All right. Well, we'll see what we can start. We'll start a GoFundMe. And we'll see oh, if there's a way we can we make got it. to think of like oh, a black magic curse. You know, I'll, um, throw at her. I'll ask her that. Sure. Yes, see, what, see what out. she says. I'll see what she says. I, think I would she go bald for a million dollars. So would I. <laughs> <laughs> I wouldn't. I wouldn't. Really? Oh, fuck for a million about. dollars, you wouldn't shave your head. As if you wouldn't. No. You've shaved your head before insane. for free. Yeah, that's because I was walked defending down my the country. fucking driveway with a million dollars cash and said, "Shave your head right now," and that's it. You don't have to be permanently. Bored. Oh, sh- just to shave my head for a bit. Yeah, yeah, for a million dollars. Yeah. Right now, though, right before your wedding. Oh fuck yes. <laughs> yeah. I would fucking eat that million dollars up, and I'd be like, "Look, this, yeah." Worth well, it. guess what we've done, Michael. Yes! Bring it in the million dollars. I wish, uh, man. That'd be so one day, day maybe. Episode. One day, maybe. One day, maybe oh. we can do that. <laughs> Imagine if Marty got a loan for a million dollars and put it down. Yeah, fuck. Well, that'd be good. Yeah. The fuck. bank wouldn't even be able to give that in cash. They can't even give 10 grand out. Anyway, that's another story. Bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Drink mother. All right, let's do the fucking sponsors. Oh, by the way, guys, today we got um we got some guests coming on soon. The Reese Bros. All right, they're like up and coming 
TikTok slash Instagram guys. They do little skits, little Aussie skits. Yeah, very funny boys. Yeah, super nice boys. We met them at the Gary V thing. Oh, did you? Yeah, and um, we're like, fucking come on, boys, come on. And uh, so they'll be on soon. I might kiss one. Yeah, have a go at it. <laughs> Tom and Kel. And their names are, and um, yeah, so they'll, they'll be joining us today, and you guys can get a bit of an insight into what it's like to be a um, an up and coming um, content creator. You know, we're very we're good at get up and coming. Up and coming. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, let's read that. <laughs> Oh man, yeah, we had Misfit Minds on. Now yeah. look how big. Yeah, that they we big. We fully blew the Misfit yeah. Minds up. It's probably uh, pretty much our fault that they're yeah, as big as they are now. Yeah. Sorry about that, Misfit yeah, Minds. Sorry, guys. Fame is a Didn't curse. Didn't mean to put you up there. James Lee, he's now famous. Yep. And uh, and that's it. Yep. In Portugal? We're yeah. getting, we put Portugal since, on the map. Ever since we announced that Willem Powerfish is coming on the finale, he's just blown up. He yeah. is Portuguese. Paulie and Flopper are out oh, of Oh, yeah. They were, no one knew who they were. And no now one. everyone knows who they are. Austin that's and Jaden. Austin and Jaden. They were yeah, that's nobodies. Right. That's right. They were absolute nobodies. And then Mike, suddenly. Mike Goldman. <sighs> we had. Oh, who else did we have? Fucking. Mike Goldman. Gerald Time. Oh, Gerald Time. Yeah. He was cool. Anyway, it's time for the sponsors, everybody. Go to manscaped.com and look after your own personal looks first. That you is priority number one. First. Your looks come first, right? Because after you look good, everything else falls into place. Sex. Why do you think we have the lives that we have? We are fucking good looking dudes. We've had sex. We groom ourselves. We have sex. We groom ourselves. And now look, we have these awesome, massive, huge podcasts. And Matt's dressed as a woman and still has a full-time fucking job. Life couldn't get any better for all all of us is exactly where Matt wanted to be at 43 years of age. I got a girlfriend. Huge, yeah, huge. Goes, Matt yeah. has a fucking and girlfriend now. They've probably had sex. And Matt has a fucking girlfriend right now. And do you think that's a coincidence? No. He went to manscaped.com and boom, his life is not pathetic anymore. I shaved he's my a, balls. He's a fucking normal person now, all right? Manscaped.com, get all your male grooming products, fully actual 20s, a discount code, you get 20% off. You can shave your nose, your balls, they got ball wipes, shave your chest and face. You got to do your face because you're competing with who don't have any hair. Yeah! yeah. Women! Yeah. Women! Yeah. Women! Men! Yes. Women. Yes. Women. Women! We have sex! Women have I sex! Shaved. Women! With, yeah, we have sex with women. And, and of course, are you feeling a little like flat and down and you're not sure what's going on and you're like, oh, I can't lose this weight and I have no energy to get up and go to the gym? Well, fucking open your eyes and look at me. Look deep into into my eyes. Look into my eyes. Get a real close up of my face, Connor. Everyone, stare into my eyes. Buy a G one. The link is in the description. It has seventy five essential nutrients and minerals that you won't get from a fucking diet. All right? There's heaps of shit you're missing out on. Your body's craving it. It doesn't know what's going on. Right? And you're fucking your life up. Go to ag one dot com slash fully actual and you, you you pay for a subscription the powder rocks up at your front door you have a scoop a day and you feel great do you want to feel great or not ask yourself what's more important or uh, uh, having a bit more money in my world so i can go to the pokies or your fucking health ask yourself what would you do if you were diagnosed with something tomorrow you'd feel guilt let me tell you Nothing worse than health scares. Yeah. AG1. Let them out, but fix your cat. Also for women. Link in the description. Just have a look at it. It's fucking crazy. Good, you cat. Joe Rogan even fucking raves about it. (laughs) 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 Oh. AG1.com, okay? This is people's health, Michael. And it's he- it's tasty. <laughs> it's also for women. We need to have a chat. <laughs> oh, man. Like we're trying to be, we're trying to seriously sell the we're, health. We're and professionals of the future. <laughs> oh fuck! And man. of course, our subscription website. 
the University of Markle, where we have two new content creators posting weekly videos True. as a free 21 day trial. So you can watch the content, see if you like it before you all start paying. Link in the description. It literally funds everything that we do. So if you sign up, you're supporting the podcast and you're supporting all of us, except for Matt, who doesn't need support because he goes to his concrete tower every day and screams at mostly women and minority groups there. Yeah, but if you do support the boys more and more, I won't need to be supported by the concrete because I might be able to get supported. Yeah, You're not signed up? I'm not signed up. So you're asking them to support you when you I want mean, support? I mean, no, support you so you can support me. <laughs> <laughs> Look, if you want us to support Matt Brown, sign up to the website. Um, Did we talk about the fire that happened? Milk filming here? I mean, we were doing it the podcast as it was sort of happening oh uh, yeah that's did we true. really speak about because i think so didn't we because it wasn't we had, last week it was, was a there week a before. fire here it was only we only touched on it more and more no i'm pretty sure we did talk about it there was a fire welcome yeah. to the podcast michael you fucking <laughs> idiot <laughs> <laughs> it was fire here? <laughs> <laughs> it's only just registered that michael's mind is always <laughs> three minutes behind <laughs> Were we talking about fires for a bit? Yeah. Okay. We were. Fuck. Yeah, no, look, yeah, we did talk about Big it. Big I, I remember we spoke. Well, I know we spoke because James was here in his outfit and um and stuff, but I don't know if there was there more to talk about that. Or yeah, it comes we... out 31st of October. Yeah, it's it's like a, a TV away. show. They're making it. They're going to pitch it to shows and um, post it on their YouTube channel. And we're all in it. And it's probably going to be fucking hilarious. If you've seen their sketches, they're like a minute and a half usually. This is 30 minutes long. So it's like a cracking milk sketch, but hugely long. So I'm expecting it to be fucking hilarious. It was so much fun to do. Everyone was so cool to hang out with. They were really my people too, because everyone was doing jokes about movies. There were Star Wars jokes going on and okay, Lord of the man. Rings. All right, that's enough, man. I was bring, I was repping worms hard. Sorry. Oh, oh yeah, Michael did bring worms. Sorry. Anyway, we've spoken about this. But did you hear fucking Nickelodeon? You know the cartoon Oh, place? yeah, I know kids? Nickelodeon. Well. They're, they're fucking talking to Connor. He met the other guy that that runs or works the Australian rep for Nickelodeon. Wow. So that's fucking awesome. If they can get picked up by Nickelodeon, then it's like a children's channel, but- And they're pretty much Jake Paul. Yeah. Yeah, Disney. All right, we're going to have a fucking fat bong break. And we when we come back, we're going to be sitting there with the Reese bros and we're going to talk to them about everything that's happened today. Sorry. Bong break. <laughs> So with our guests today, guys, um, we've told them beforehand a bunch of facts about Matt Brown that they have memorized, and they're going to pretend that they have all of these really insane, obscure things in common with Matt Brown, and watch how excited Matt Brown gets during this, okay? This is a, a lie, so that, that will happen during the guest part of the show. And sit back and enjoy. And we're back, and we are here with the Reese bros up and coming what would you call yourselves tiktokers content creators like what you got tiktok you guys every fucking thing you guys post gets millions of views would you say tiktok's your main platform yeah, yeah. i suppose so eh? i don't really like being seen as a tiktoker yeah probably. yeah it's kind of like, <laughs> they're, like they're, things, they're eh? social media creators yeah yeah influencers yeah. mad cat we make videos. <laughs> we make videos. <laughs> yeah. So, so introduce yourselves, boys. Who are you? And and um, let let the audience know a little bit about what you do exactly. Uh, so we're two brothers that um, make uh, relatable like comedy content on yeah TikTok, Instagram, and all those kind of places. And uh, basically, we just pull the piss out of Australian culture. Yeah. It's yeah, a so. fucking one of the easiest places to pull the piss yeah, out. Of. Literally, yeah. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, that's just what we know. And like. Um, Pretty much all of our videos revolve around that, and yeah, so like Aussie comedy skits. Yeah, yeah pretty much. Yeah. Similar, yeah. you boys have done in the past. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. You're the goats of it, eh? Well, <laughs> we're watching that fucking one the other day. Aussie dad comes to uh, fucking Jeffrey Dahmer. Jeffrey uh, Dahmer. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, that yeah, that's so Julian. Good. Julian's one. He the did, ending oh, was, was brilliant. Oh, yeah, you played Dharma, didn't you? No, I, I played the Aussie. Yeah. Oh. 
and That's Julian right. was Julian How was, was that? Drama. And yeah. you drank a many like all the cups and you still That's not a podcast. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's yeah. The best ones the ones where you don't expect the ending out. Eh? Yeah, <laughs> like that. Yeah. That's what we're always like trying to think about like how can we just be like, make people go, What the fuck? Yeah, yeah, at yeah. the end or just do something that's like doesn't make any sense or yeah, just random. fucking stupid. Yeah, yeah. 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 So, so like, what he's on on TikTok now, he's uh, growing pretty quick, eh? Yeah, yeah. we're so like, nearly on six hundred, so we pretty much like we didn't start like a year ago, but like we kind of like we were fucking around a little bit and then like we're like pretty much a year ago uh a week like a year and a week ago like we was like fuck it let's take it seriously and then we just started going crazy straight away yeah so like yeah. a year ago we had a thousand followers and then now it's like we're on yeah 680 on oh, sorry, six yeah six uh, 580 sorry on yeah, tiktok yeah. and then 200 on insta yeah, yeah fuck, fuck yeah, yeah man. that's so good um so who's so uh Tom? Yeah. Tom Kel. and Kel. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. And yeah. your brothers. Who's, yeah. who's yeah, the yeah. older brother? Oh, you? guess. I reckon... Oh, you probably... <laughs> there's more age wisdom in you. There's more... I can see youth in you in the yeah. eyes. Oh, uh, thank you. That <laughs> looks a bit more weathered than I do. Yeah, everyone, yeah. everyone's yeah. 28 all the time. <laughs> I fucking get rattled. How yeah. old are you, boys? I'm um, 22, he's 23. Yeah, yeah right. Yeah. Oh, yeah. fuck, man. So young. Remember being fuck. that young? <laughs> We're over 10 years older than you. <laughs> So fucked, man. That means oh. when we were eighteen, we were probably would have been coaching them. <laughs> yeah, we would be. We probably coach. You guys play tennis. Yeah, yeah you, yeah, you can coach us tennis. now if you want. <laughs> <laughs> you guys Holy are pretty um, tall and athletic. Do you guys play any any sport? Uh, I've been into soccer a fair bit. Yeah, yeah, we both played a little bit of soccer. soccer yeah. Fans, uh, oh yeah, yeah. It's yeah, so good. You support any any like any of the Aussie teams? Right? Yeah. Well, Dad was like you know a big Arsenal fan back in the day, so yeah, we've been supporting them pretty much since day one. But what? Oh, oh fuck you! <laughs> <you're laughs> <a house, right? laughs> Holy shit! So, Browns just yeah. <laughs> oh, up. and that's the other thing. Uh, you guys, when you guys came in, you got we found out you guys are from Palm Beach. Yeah, as well, yeah. Right? yeah, yeah, yeah. Crazy. Which is, is where Matt is from. Yeah. What the fuck is with Palm Beach? And, yeah. Bro, the Palm Yard meets the yeah. Yeah. <laughs> That's so Gold Coast. Matt's yeah. the leader of the Palm Yard. <laughs> 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 he started. <laughs> he started. <laughs> I don't see that. Well, that's a core. That's a core Palmy. Yeah, yeah it is. Eh? <laughs> it's a fucking central. Four two two. One forever. Oh, <laughs> oh, oh. oh shit! So, do you guys? So, are you guys? Do you still have like a, a job as well, or are you guys full content creation now? Oh, so we buy and sell furniture. Oh, in yeah. the Arvo. So You're we kidding do. me? Yeah, yeah. yeah pretty much. That's why. That's why when Tom walked in, he was sussing out your couches. He's like, <laughs> yeah. how, how much could I sell for those? <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, true. Yeah. 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 Do it up. Owner. Do you do it nah, up? No, no, we don't. We just like pretty much rip. Off, eh? like, <laughs> yeah. So you buy it for like <laughs> five hundred and sell it for six hundred. Yeah, no, yeah, pretty much. Yeah, so more, more like get it for free, sell it for six hundred. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, <right. laughs> Holy fuck! And you guys make a killing doing that. Oh, it's just enough to survive. Really. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Wow. You can push it further, but obviously we're trying yeah. to do like the content shit. Yeah, yeah. yeah well, well, that's that's what we sort of had to do the Uber driving. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I remember hearing that. Yeah, but yeah. Like that's such a genius idea. Yeah, yeah. man. If we, we if we were smart enough, we. Oh, I suppose you need a Ute and shit too, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah I got a Ute. Yeah, or yeah. if that white car had a tow ball, you could have used that. That <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> thing is well, yeah, you guys could, If you want, you can try and sell that. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We we'll give you on the back. We'll give an old photo when it wasn't fucked and then put it up on Marketplace. That's pretty much what we do anyway. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Falls hey, on the back of the tray and you go, oh, well. Photos, I got photos before that. So. <laughs> so what did you guys do? Did you guys have like a, a job before that? Or you guys just always been f flicking? Yeah, so it? pretty much Kel was a plumber. And then um, I was a real estate agent and I fucking hate I ended up hating it yeah, real bad. And then, rough. yeah, it's fucking terrible. But then I quit and I saw on TikTok the, the couch flipping thing. And I was like, oh, fuck, I'll just give it a go. I don't have a job. And then I just figured it out straight away. And then I've been, I've pretty much been doing it for like nearly three years now. So, so, so you just find shit. free <laughs> yeah, shit. You just yeah. find free shit. Yeah. You go and pick it up. You yeah. put it on for sale and then just drop it off. Yeah, yeah. pretty much. Yeah, yeah. So okay. Delivery is like the king. Yeah. That's what I just, I had to finish my trade. I was like itching to get out of it. I got, I got sick of playing with shit. So, uh, <laughs> <laughs> so then, yeah, Tom, Tom kind of pulled me out of that. And yeah. then as soon as we both pulled, like got pulled out of the, like the jobs we were doing, the full-time jobs, that's when the content started to come out. We both split up with missos at the same time as well. Yeah, and, just, and then we had all this free time and we're making a bit of enough money and 
you know, we just started starting on content. Yeah, we yeah. have like a whole day pretty much to do content. And then from like three o'clock onwards, we do furniture. So it's fucking yeah, wow. fun. That's yeah. awesome. Good yeah, on you. So good, eh? It's yeah, your, your vids are getting better and better, I've noticed. They're, they're very, it gave us like um, inspired, unemployed yeah, vibes. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Yeah. You guys watch? Yeah yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, they're probably like one of the main reasons you got into it. Like yeah, we always it inspired us a bit. Yeah. Sort of like liked watching content. We watched you boys for ages and heaps of other content creators as well. And uh, I think their style just kind of stood out to us. When we yeah. saw it and then yeah yeah pretty much you know like they they got like the whole brand coming out and all that kind of that's kind oh of, man yeah. they're like massive now yeah, yeah. yeah. so well it's like, like yeah that's like the dream run yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. Done well. and yeah. you guys are good because you guys when you get to a certain size you're very like commercial friendly there aren't going to be many brands that want to yeah. steer clear of you guys which is what we've always had issues with yeah <laughs> your shit won't get demonetized yeah. all the time yeah, yeah. yeah. That's so true eh? you so, guys be struggling yeah, with that you guys fu- hey we're from, yeah. <laughs> we're from yeah. Palmy. Yeah. <laughs> Common theme from Palmy people. <laughs> oh, what star sign are you guys? I'm a Pisces. And Pisces. Um, fuck, I don't know. I'm an Aquarius or some shit. I don't even fucking oh, know. Oh, yeah. oh, you cunts have got me saying or some shit. It's fucked. <laughs> it is so fucked. Because you say it in the Tinder adventures all the time. And then now I'm, I say it all the time. It's so fucked. I haven't even noticed that yet, but I probably. I probably <laughs> what a, some shit. What, what month so is bad. Pisces again? March, brother. Yeah, March, baby. Oh, fucking hell, Matt. What month, when in March are you? On the eighth. Oh my god! I'm oh, oh, bullshit! No way! What the? No way! 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 I got my mm-hmm. wallet here. I got my license. Wow. If I have my wallet, who can? Oh shit! You guys, maybe you guys are the same. Yeah, <laughs> maybe you guys are the same. Is that why you're wearing the mum outfit? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh fuck me! It must be that's that's, that's connection. Up, man. Similar, man. right? I mean, yeah, yeah, imagine if Matt was your dad somehow. Oh, <laughs> or my mum at the moment. Oh, or his real brother, bro. I'm probably not your brother. Makes sense. Matt was the mistake that your parents <laughs> threw in the trash <laughs> now that makes sense no. <laughs> yeah. do you have any other siblings then uh we've got like a stepsister that's about it yeah that's it yeah, yeah. oh yeah older yeah, yeah she's yeah, older yeah she's way older we don't really get to see her that much yeah she's Sucks. like the producer of um louis a uh, bluey you know the, the tv show all right, you guys cool? <laughs> 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 I got a bit excited. I got a bit excited. Wait, 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 Brown thought Brown thought that was real. That was all alive. We were from Palm Beach, man. Oh, yes. oh, we were lying off Mark. He's not even the Reese Bros. Yeah, we don't even make content. You're not even on TikTok, man. Uh, oh, oh, so where are you from? <laughs> Palm Beach. <laughs> he goes for Arsenal. Um, yeah, they don't even go for Arsenal. There was so many things. Oh, if we could go anywhere in the world, we'd be fucking like now. We're putting his hands up. Mongo- yeah. We're going to Mongolia in, in next month. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. yeah, we basically so basically we gave the Reese Bros like a whole bunch of facts about Matt Brown and just said, "Can you memorize this?" And then when we ask you questions, just bring up and just sort of subtly put it in that this. This is that and then Brown <laughs> thought that they had all these connections but there was no connection I felt the arousalment from, from Brown behind me <laughs> is this, is this <laughs> breath on my back so now that all that lying's done do you guys actually play any other sport because you guys are fucking big boys you guys um, are, oh we fucking played a bit of footy back in the day but yeah I would have like, suggested AFL yeah. or something nah nah no, no, yeah league we'll get, oh, union we're getting like fucking smoked eh? we're like yeah. skinny as fuck but <laughs> yeah. yeah we did a little bit of that back in the day you definitely could have played AFL yeah I probably he's I probably quick. should have played AFL yeah. like, uh, he's, kind of we're part of Aboriginal he's yeah. Aboriginal <laughs> yeah. Yeah. got a bit of speed on me <laughs> <laughs> and um no we just pretty much surfed because we grew up in Evans Head you guys know what that is no. near Ballina oh yeah yeah down know, south Ballina, near yeah. Byron yeah, oh, right. dude, it's so nice there. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's, good. it's good. Okay. We've when we went on our road trip when we were eighteen, we stopped in that that place, oh, that really? beach. It's like oh. a little beach. You have to go. And it's like a roundabout that you come back, right? Yeah, I made that. 
It's, it's really so I'm confident. We did actually yeah. stay there. I was like, there's, four, there's two roundabouts yeah. in town. Talking about them. We slept, we slept there for a night. Oh, was that that beach? We yeah. slept on the footpath and it was raining? No, nah, that was Yamba. But the, ah. we, yeah, we slept in yeah, the van that it's night. Near yeah, yeah, yeah. Unless you it's so pretty there. Yeah, no, the rock walls. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it has it's the like, same, but yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyway, yeah, we grew up there and all you could really do there was skate or surf. So that's pretty much what you did. Yeah, Or you could play footy, but obviously Tom said we'd fucking got too skinny and we are getting so hurt. Hurt, hey, hey, losing as well, so yeah, because yeah, your yeah. knees would be like the height of someone's head. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Just get cut yeah easy to tackle, bro. <laughs> yeah. Holy shit. So, what's your hobbies? What are you guys like doing? If do you guys play golf? Do you guys get fucked no, up? Oh, sorry, I'll back off. We get fucking so fucked up. Eh? <laughs> we went to Bali and got fucked up every day. Like, oh, dude, the whole yeah. time. But twenty three, you've fuck. got to. That's yeah, just standard you practice. Have to, eh? You can take yeah. it. You're following oh. in your footsteps. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Bali's so good for it. Like yeah. it's just so cheap, and it's just fuck. You can just did you get on the gear as well, or just the yeah? You get yeah. killed if you get caught with it. There, oh, yeah, it's risky, but, but that's what sort of yeah. makes it fun too. Well, that's what we said. Yeah, Bali's it's just accommodating. Of, yeah, yeah. <laughs> anything you want, you can you can buy it. Yeah. Yeah. Get it, yeah, like even uh-huh. the other day, I have like this. You know the scooter rider jackets, the Gojek jackets. Mm. I had one of them, and everyone's like, "How'd you get that?" And I'm like. All you need to do is fucking give them money. Yeah, you say, yeah, yeah you you cash want. and get whatever you want. I remember I got an ID for like because I was trying to get uh, to say I went to UQ like yeah. as a uni yeah. student so I could get like discounts and shit, oh. concession. So I just got it made over in Bali. No way. We should try and buy a baby over there. I wonder if you should. <laughs> Probably, up to Probably a Probably gave flash enough cash, see how much money a mum would give a baby up for. Dude, that, I would watch that video. Is that too fucked though? Well, we give it back yeah, after. Yeah, yeah. You no, say, just kidding yeah. and let them keep the money. You keep it. Like, yeah, we well, try and breastfeed and, it. Yeah, oh, I, I reckon you get stuff. away with it. Have you seen in the traffic lights? They just had their baby and they almost put it in your arms. Yeah. Trying to get you to give them money. Oh, well, <laughs> yeah. It's like an exchange. Oh, yeah. I'll, I'll take it. Yeah, how much? I mean, this title. Like, how much is a baby yeah. in Bali? Yeah, oh, <laughs> and we'll try and get it in through customs. <laughs> <laughs> we'll just put it under our. F- and go through the. <laughs> <laughs> so, do you guys go out a bit now, or because you, you guys oh. are prime right now, or do you guys just fucking? Um, no, we kind of keep it a bit ch- more chill here in Oz. Yeah, but we did oh, go we, out in the weekend. We try to, yeah. Yeah, yeah I don't know. It depends. Hard. Like you know, you just the same. Like when you go out here, you just like your brain doesn't work. Hey. Eh? Yeah. Oh no, oh, yeah. yeah. It's a, it's a, one of our biggest regrets is forming yeah. some really bad habits in our twenties. We just would fuck ourselves far too often. Yeah. Mm. Well, that was like today. We wanted to do like a video with you boys, and then we're like. Oh, the ideas that were coming over head just weren't that yeah, good. And we, we went like, out on Saturday. <laughs> want to do it properly. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You know yeah, I mean? yeah boys, like, you're welcome yeah. anytime to come up and film some shit. <laughs> Break but some yeah. shit. Yeah. <laughs> Man, so where do you guys I'm live now? In uh, Goldie? Ch- Chugan, yeah. Oh, I meant uh, Chugan. Not in Bab. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, we're in Chugan, so just up the road pretty much. Yeah, yeah. nice. Uh, it's a good spot. Oh, so what, so is our, um, doing the social media shit, has, any, has your life changed at all yet? Or like, do you guys get stopped in the streets yet? Do you guys get recognised a little? Yeah, we notice like a lot more with the kids, hey? Yeah, literally, yeah. Hey, like, um, yeah, a lot of the kids like love it. I don't know if they, maybe they have more confidence or something. They just like froth out when they see us. But yeah, yeah. Well, I, think, I think with your content as well, like when you have a pop and video that week, you you always notice that as well. Mm. You get hell noticed, like yeah. hectically. Yeah. And then like say if your content starts going shit, you know, yeah. obviously it drops down. <laughs> yeah. So you got to yeah, be relevant 100%. to get it. Hey. Yeah. Yeah. Literally. Do, do people get confused with your names? Um. Some people just call us a TikToker, Zach. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Not yeah, even really on the first name basis with most people, eh? Yeah, yeah I reckon yeah. most people call me Michael. It's so uh, weird. Yeah. I get Marty all the time. I feel like you yeah. look like a Marty and you look like a Michael. I don't know. I reckon, <laughs> eh? <laughs> but yeah. Oh, shit. What does Matt look like? I, I, I reckon your name fits. <laughs> <Very good>. <laughs> 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 Matt, or Matt Smith, that would fit as well. <laughs> so, what's the plan with it all? You guys like want to become like just get paid for your content, basically, and just do it full time? Is that the goal? That would be yeah. the goal for sure. Yeah, but we we like we're working on a podcast at the moment. Um, so that's probably like the next thing. But we're just doing like one thing at a time, really. Yeah, yeah. like mm. we haven't got anything like super far in the future it's kind of just like oh this is what we're going to work on now and if it, yeah. if it pays off it pays off if not you know our yeah. brains don't work that far in the future yeah, yeah. 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 so young like, obviously like in the future yeah we'd love to like you know just cruise a bit more and like have mm. you know a comfortable life but like for now yeah it's like one thing at a time otherwise we just fucking yeah. we can't just, do like 10 things at once we just, yeah as long as you just, just keep doing it that's just, <laughs> just yeah, yeah, yeah that's stick to thing, it yeah. something's going to happen yeah, yeah 22 and 23 was it yep. yeah. yeah man when we were that age we were still fucking 
coaching full time, hadn't yeah. even started making videos and oh, just going Columbia. overseas. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, right. When did you guys start? To like 26, 27? Yeah, probably, yeah. Quite late. Fucking so you guys have got well, a good that, head start. You guys are still early though. Like you're still like like some of the OG. Yeah, some of the OG like guys. That's probably yeah. I wish thing. we got in a bit earlier though, because we were just fucking around on YouTube for a good like three years before we went onto Facebook. Yeah, mm. yeah, yeah. And Facebook was like so good back in the day. Yeah, you post yeah. a video, get like a hundred million views in like fucking two days. It's just crazy. nuts. Yeah, there you there could post whatever you want. Michael could rip his toenails off on Facebook without any issues. Eat and dog shit. Eat dog shit. All fine. It wouldn't get taken down. No. Now it just get. Fucking oh, now we'd uh, we'd be deleted and cancelled immediately. Yeah, I, I'm surprised you guys have you guys had any dramas with like TikTok because we have fucking yeah. so many problems. Mm. Yeah, our videos right. are like chill out. It's like they're nothing compared to you. Yeah, guys. we um pretty much every second video gets deleted or that restricted or, yeah, or uh, yeah. and we're banned from going live as well. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck that. Uh, it's a bit sh- fucking shit, but yeah, yeah TikTok sucks. Eh? <laughs> yeah, it's so fucked. That's why you got the um exclusive. Okay. Yeah, that's why we got the website. Yeah, that's pretty much our bread and butter these days. But it's scary because, like, yeah, the rules keep changing, and then they'll just delete videos from like two years ago, back when the rules were different. Yeah. Oh. So yeah, but anyway, yeah. but your exclusive things all sweet, eh? Like you can do whatever you want in there. Yeah, because that's why we're like, let's make it, our yeah. own website yeah. so that no, there's no rules. You never yeah, know where the fire goes. Yeah. We had the other day. Um, we did a video where Tom was the mum. And it was just like oh, saying how like so when you have fun. to ask, you know, when you go with a mate and you're trying to ask your mum to go like to your mate's house and you ask your mate to ask your mum. Hey, yeah, Mrs. Oh, yeah. Mrs. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Like, you see, your mate sometimes has it over it a little yeah, bit. Like, I'm not going to say no to my, like, you know, my son's friend. Anyway, we did a video about that. And at the start, Tom smashes a plate. Yeah, you yeah. flip your shit. I yeah, saw yeah, it. Yeah, 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 yeah. And it's been out for probably two weeks now. And then we get a call from the real estate last week. <laughs> Being like, so fucked. what the fuck is this video you put up? Like, yeah. you, like you're damaging property. For smashing oh. a plate. Yeah. Oh, dude, that's so rough. See so how yeah. good yeah. we have it here? Yeah, we're yeah. very lucky. So lucky. And like, yeah. it was like some fucking stone bench. She was top. saying like the owners saw it and they were like sending messages at like one o'clock in the morning, like oh my massive God. paragraphs about it. Man, that like, is so rules. Yeah, 100%. Oh, yeah. So sucks. shit, eh? I was it's just like, a stupid thing. Wall thing, <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's a floor. Yeah. Is it a bench? Bench top. Like, yeah, oh, same like, thing. Floor, bench, wall. Yeah. There, there was a little scratch, and then we have to. We got to like pay like fucking like five hundred bucks to go get someone to come out and look so at it. One couch, then, one couch yeah. worth. Yeah. Of yeah. <laughs> 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 the whole time we're that. that couch, we're gonna be so off it. Yeah. Oh fuck this couch. Oh my god, man. <laughs> so, like, wow. so you guys are renting at the moment? Yeah. And yeah. just you two living together? And another mate. Yeah, we got a yeah. mate in there. Does he get involved? In him? Yeah, yeah occasionally, sometimes. yeah. He's pretty busy, but like he's always doing stuff. So yeah, yeah. yeah. He does the furniture as well. Yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, fuck. So, so cool. everyone in the neighborhood just seeing the lounges and shit <laughs> yeah. everywhere. They're all that sus on us. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> What's the longest you've driven to pick up like a free item? Oh, I've definitely I've came up here a few times, uh, and that's like oh, really? fucking two hour drive through peak traffic. That yeah, was pretty bad. Okay. <laughs> My fucking car has no aircon, no radio. It's like the fucking <laughs> the two windows are smashed. He's asking like, for a handout, basically. Fuck, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, is that white car for sale? Yeah. yeah no, Holy it, shit! Well, there you go. Well, hopefully everyone doesn't start catching on now. Hopefully, fucking, there's not going to be like twenty competitors by the time yeah, this comes out. Selling couches and making TikToks. Fuck that. <laughs> yeah. What is your What is your family? Cut that thing? out. No. <laughs> 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 oh shit! We can if you want. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, please do. No, no, no. Nah, okay. Yeah, what's the what's the family think of the vids? Uh, at the start, they were like so fucking off us. They were yeah. like, "What are you wasting your time for?" You know. Yeah. Definitely. And then after like you know people around the community and that kind of get around it and that mm. people tell them they think it's funny, then they to kind of start to change their mind. Yeah. At the start, they were so off us. At yeah, it. they were fucking off us. They did not like it at all. It's kind of like when you can't really justify something, it's like hard for someone to believe in you. So yeah, yeah, we we're like um. Well, even now, like, cause we want to get dad, like people always message, oh, dad review, dad review, all this shit. And then like, there's a couple, like one or two blokes in fucking the small town we live in, Evan's head that like kind of bag, bag what we do to him. Like, oh, the boys need to go get a fucking job. Like they need to fucking contribute to society and shit. And then <laughs> it gets in his head and he's like, I'm not fucking getting on it, boys. Like it's just so, <laughs> yeah. it sucks so much. Oh, oh damn. damn. Yeah, it's so No, nah, no, nah, we'll get him on there. We'll get yeah. him. <laughs> he won't know it. <laughs> no, we're thinking. 
Oh, man, we shouldn't, because what he watches this. We think we're going to like, um, just call him and do that kind of shit. Just call him. Like, yeah. You always do that as well. You just call him randomly. Yeah, yeah, we'll yeah. just call that and ask him some weird questions and just see. Maybe we could fucking do a prank call on him today. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> we could. Right. Yeah. Oh, that's but like, he'd probably be okay. put him on the radar too much that he's like, oh, shit, I will watch yeah. the podcast. But it's up to you, boys. <laughs> could be I'd, be, I'd do it, I'd do it for sure. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> you so should call him up and say that you're pregnant. What would he do? <laughs> oh, I don't oh, know. Wait, they're pretty cool with that <laughs> shit, eh? You, think you can call them and tell them you think you, that your mum's hot? <laughs> oh, no. Well, I know it would piss him off if we told him, if we called him and told him the car's fucking broken oh, down. We're yeah. halfway to the sunny coast trying to pick up a couch. Because yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that gets him. Like, a lot of the times when we're like ringing him, like, we always have some sort of issue going on. Eh? Yeah, with the car. He's like a bit, he's like, he's like real good with mechanics and stuff. Yeah, and it always just like ends up getting stitched up with our shit. <laughs> so like, if you ever call him, or say my, my dad, my phone's out, of, like my car's out of rego, and I've just been pulled over. Like yeah. Someone like he would lose it. Yeah, okay. Like, he'd probably yeah. end the call on you. Yeah. <laughs> call back in like 10 and be like, Are you all good, bro? Yeah. <laughs> oh, wow. Well, okay. Well, something to consider. Oh, yeah. Yeah. All yeah. right. Well, fuck, boys. Well, thanks for um, coming on. And um, yeah. So, everyone, if you want to have a look at what they do, Reese Bro. So, R W E C E B R O S. S. Or oh, R -E so it's R W -E S E. S E, sorry. Yeah. Like the chocolate. Reese, yeah, uh, that's it. Yep. On Instagram and TikTok. And do you guys have YouTube yet? Yeah, we just have YouTube shorts, yeah. It's yep. almost like cross posting. Yeah. Yep. And Facebook? And Facebook as well, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, well there you go. Reese Bros on all platforms. Give them a bloody watch, everyone. <laughs> all right, we're gonna have a uh, quick bong break and we'll be right back with Matt versus Michael. And we're back. All right. As you can see, the brown is back on his brown little couch playing with his dress. And now it is time for Matt versus Michael. Hit it, Brown. Oh, shit. Quickly. Oh. Three, two, oh. one. Hit it, Matt. Matt versus Michael. It's Matt versus Michael. It's Matt versus Michael today. <laughs> Matt versus Michael. It's Matt versus Michael. It's Matt versus Michael today. Yay. Come, come. Bottle of cum. All right, for today's competition, this is a segment, by the way, everyone, where Matt and Michael go head to head against each other and we see who the better man is. I test them every week on their physical skill, their intelligence, everything. And the winner gets to keep the famous bottle of mints that you see in this box right here. And they can do with it whatever they want. So there's a lot on the line here. Oh, we haven't shown you the bottle, have we? The mince bottle, Matt. Sorry. It's mince. mince it's, bottle. Not, it's, not, it's not. Yeah, I was remember? kind of hoping to see that. Yeah, you will. <laughs> Should we show them at the end? Oh, yeah, yeah, we'll show yeah. you off camera we'll because show we're, not camera. we're not allowed to show it anyway. They know now. No, I was going to show you guys my nuts because they're like really. Yeah, show us after. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we can all show each other our nuts. <laughs> <laughs> and we can make them all touch like a, like a four way kiss. Biggest nuts. <laughs> 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 Matt's got huge nuts too Big fucking Probably cancerous Little massive nuts <laughs> Big yeah. boulders Still and ejaculate there Oh yeah <laughs> And today The competition is Who is better At styling hair Matt and Michael Will be choosing One of the brothers And styling their hair <laughs> Alright So And then we will be judging All of us Who gave them The better hairstyle Boys do you mind Getting your hair fucked With a little bit oh, Not cut or anything It's just gonna be Styled Cut it if you want <laughs> Okay yeah, well, then I'd love that I'll just shave I'll just shave One of their head Alright um, Paper scissors rock boys And then the winner Gets to pick the model That they wanna work with Scissors, paper, rock. Yes! All right. You just get to pick them up. <laughs> I'll go with Kel. All right, let me get... James, I see you. 
<laughs> what am I meant to do? Don't do that angry face. No, <laughs> this is what you do. You do this every fucking time. Uh, you come in here and so you say enjoy. something and then you change the rules. Matt, don't <laughs> argue with the judges. Brown, judge Brown, you. Brown oh, calm fuck down. You. And you know I'll win. <laughs> fuck you. <laughs> it's not a good idea to argue with the judges, oh, man. I love this. It's not a good idea. It's a good All right, so, yeah. to win over here. so <laughs> James, Ryan, and Cooper <laughs> will be the judges. You have three minutes. You can style the hair however you like. We are looking for the coolest hairstyle, okay? Original, cool, fucking just sexy, all right? That's what we're looking for. You got three minutes, all right? Your time starts now. Here we go. Here we go. Getting the feel, yeah. <laughs> all right, they're both working hard. None of them have gone for any product yet. Oh, Michael has. What the fuck is that, Michael? Isn't that for, Just isn't, that, isn't that for your body? <laughs> Dude, that's yeah, the what you want. What you want. All right, we're coming up to 30 <laughs> seconds gone now. Not much has happened yet. How do chicks do this? <laughs> In my eyes. <laughs> all right, we're coming up to a minute here. Remember the small talk, guys, like all hair dress, oh, yeah, all yeah, hairdressers do. One minute gone. Any trips to Bali lately? <laughs> <laughs> what happened? Bali, boys. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, How long have they got, Mark? They got two minutes left, under two minutes now. I'm just going to have to do a lot of this just because I need it to pop up more. Yeah, that's how we're going to win. Do you have a girlfriend? <laughs> <laughs> not yeah, yeah. What's her name? Really, I reckon uh, Russell Brand it. She's a from Bali. Do you have a girlfriend? No. He oh, does. Yeah. <laughs> he does now. Yeah. <laughs> He's so used to saying no because it's I'm been so like a decade. Uh, we are nearly at the two minute mark, boys. You got you get oh you've just done Jaden Prasad's hairstyle on him. <laughs> He's sick, eh? <laughs> Actually, he's not too bad, Michael. <laughs> oh, yeah, I don't know, I know what yeah. Matt is doing. Is it like <laughs> it's genuine style or like creative? Yeah, it's like it just I just want to be impressed. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Michael's just doing like the, Michael's like the just doing what he would do to <laughs> his own hair. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we got forty seconds left, boys. There's a final push. Here we go. I want some more small talk. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, so this is, is for free. This Come is on, for free. Oh, yeah, we're going to win. I'm just going to run out of time. I'm pretty sure I've won. Yeah, it goes if we're going style, like, Brown, I'm sorry, but that's, like, not really style. Maybe you look more fast than I already am. 15 <laughs> seconds know. left. I know it's done. <laughs> 10. Nine, <laughs> eight, seven, here, eh? six, five, four, three, two, one. Brushes down. All right, let's have a look at the front of them. Oh, oh man, you look like the fucking Edward Scissorhands. <laughs> <laughs> you look exactly the same as when you started. No, nah, that's, that's that's got a bit more zap to it. A bit more zap. That's true. I guarantee if I don't win this... You didn't do anything. He looks exactly the same. If don't, I don't win this, look, then the game is rigged. <laughs> the game is rigged. Remember, don't boys, don't listen to Michael. It's just whatever you You should win this. You better. have long hair. You should. You had a massive advantage in this. Yeah, 100. That's why I won. Yeah, we might not have. <laughs> All right, look, boys, if you saw yeah, these yeah. two lads walking down the street, what would you, what would who you would think? You who, yeah, who would you want to <laughs> fuck more? And, and like, which hairstyle would you think? Fuck, that guy knows well, what he's doing. No, if you could have a hairstyle yourselves, I reckon, what would you yeah, want? Yeah, that's yeah, a good Ryan question. Yeah, that was a good question. <laughs> All right, so Ryan's voted. Michael Cooper, what do you reckon? <laughs> all right, all right, so one all. All right, here we go. It's one all. The decider, James. Do you remember how you spoke to me before? <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm putting that aside because I, I am a, I'm a, I'm a true teacher, so I don't take. I was it came from a place of love. I don't take <laughs> them into account. Yeah. So Matt's bedside manner was superior. He was apologizing for being rough. He was checking if you were okay, yeah, whereas Michael true. was just like a moment of, of small talk. I was focused on the art. Yeah. I, I know. Oh, are you saying I naturally did what you wanted me to do? Yeah, I'm absolutely. I'm sorry, I swore you. I apologize. No, that's all right. As I said, I'm a fair scorer. Um, but Marty, I think Marty's point of 
which hairstyle would you feel better walking yeah. down the street in? I gotta go, Michael. I'm afraid. So Michael's Shame. gonna. Michael yeah. wins. He extends Shame. his lead, oh, eighteen man, to sixteen. Now, Matt, you're gonna have to yeah, win two these up. next two. Two up on This him. is getting real fucking. You gotta, you gotta win these last two. Otherwise, Chance. Michael wins and he Why gets the fucking mince bottle. So that's his. You, that was a win for him from the beginning. Matt, you used to have hair. Mate, you I haven't had hair for two hair. years. What makes you, makes you think I was gonna win a hairstyling contest? Look, it's all about you. Not you, James. Not you. Not you. No, All right, James, 18, 16 now to Michael. Fucking hell. If you win like another two, I think that's it. Wow. Uh, we should really find out if he's already won or not because when it adds up at the no, end. That's 35 now. And, and then we missed one 36, the other week because we didn't have one during the Boz I think episode, I so. think there's two more before the finale that would, yeah. that come that we film. So you're going to have to win both of them to tie it to bring it into the finale. Okay. That's fucking exciting. Oh, imagine if I can get it. Tired. Yeah, and that, that's that would be good because that would make it exciting for the finale. That but would be scary for so the finale. So I might even yeah, I might even um yeah. We'll see what competitions we come up with. Okay, so we're moving on to the end. All right. No, the, yeah, that's it. All I right. did it. I'm sorry I fucked your head. <laughs> yeah, I put so much yeah, just I just kept there slapping. Like <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to break up with me now, bro. <laughs> Dude, I've got a bald hair. I've got no hair. I didn't. Really? I had no chance. Yeah, well, I they, thought, they thought that was your real hair. Yeah. yeah that was your real hair. Wait till I do the reveal. <laughs> do I, should I do it now so yeah, they go see? On, give them a look this at what's funny. happened to you. Should I do this at the camera or at them? Wherever you feel. It's like Mrs. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's sort of nice with that too. No. It's like Mrs. Doubtfire. Yeah, it looks good. Yeah. <laughs> oh, All right, man. let's fucking. Speaking of Matt, let's move along. Uh, and uh, let's see how Matt has got, even though he's got a girlfriend now. Look, we still we still want to see where this ends, and it's good to have options too, Matt. Right? Oh, You'd agree with that, that even helps. though you have a girlfriend. See, it's not. Yeah, I do agree. It's nice to have options, but I, th I think this could be the <laughs> okay, one. We'll You've got a bit. main bitch, but you oh want some God. side bitches. This could too. be the one. <laughs> Holy exactly. shit, Matt! That's crazy. You said that, but look, it's time for Matt Brown's Tinder adventures. Hit it, man. <clears throat> T I N D R, we have Matt's Tinder. Ha ha ha. Matthew Brown has lost control now. These women will lose their souls. All right, and like we said, Matt Brown has been a very lonely, single, sad, depressed, kind of pathetic, fucking sitting around, just fucked up and sad and shit in this fucking house on his own. Not fifth, anymore. Fifth wheeling all the time. And he's just had a real shit time with girls, right? So Michael and I. But not anymore. <laughs> have taken over his Tinder. And I've got we a girlfriend. speak to girls exactly how we think Matt would speak to them and we do the work for him because his self-esteem is so at the bottom of the barrel that he doesn't know how to talk to girls anymore. It, we used, make, to, it used to be, but I've got a girlfriend. We make <laughs> girls' days. Like, they get really happy with this this dialogue. It helps yeah. them. They Look, post about it on Facebook. Matt starts with, my body is so sensitive at the moment. Have you ever heard that? As in your whole body or like a tooth? How's your week been? <clears throat> so took a, that was last Monday she messaged, didn't reply for a while. So, hey, sorry, I don't go on Tinder much. Week was hectic as shit. My body sensitivity is through the roof. Even putting shirts on hurts my skin. How's your weekend? Why such a hectic week? Maybe you need to change laundry, laundry detergent and or soap. Done anything weird to cause it? My, my weekend was good, got drunk, and I kind of did something a bit bad. Yeah, I've stopped using soap and detergent altogether. My skin just hurts so badly everywhere. It's really stunting my self-esteem. Oh no, what did you do? Sounds full on. Have you done a Google? Asked your mum? Oh, the bad thing I did? I rang my ex while I was hammered to give him some dating advice. He needed it, but he kind of started going out with his kid's second cousin. Bit gross. So absolutely understand your stunted self-esteem. Mine's fucked too. Google always just thinks everything is cancer. My mum is blind. She used to be a welder and not wear any eye protection. Her eyes are fully white now. It's gross. Oh my God. Your ex sounds so established. My skin is pink and it throbs. Even a light breeze brings me to my knees. I'm naked and I'm just calling different doctors and shit. My GP says there's nothing wrong with me. My work doesn't believe me and thinks I'm just making this shit up to get off work. I think they want to fire me. 
Oh, that's so true. Google does always think everything is cancer. Your mum sounds hardcore. Fuck. That's some Game of Thrones shit. What does she do now? And yeah, my ex is established with a relative. At least they can save money on the wedding. Half the fam. My friend's ex left her for her cousin too. Must be a thing to combat cost of living. Your work sounds like a bunch of ass hats. What do you do? <clears throat> my mum just lives off dis- disability payments now. She loves cake. Yeah, that's hectic as shit. Their kids are going to come out with like six arms and shit. <laughs> they could be mutants. I used to train jujitsu so I could fight crime. I stopped a few years ago when I hurt my knee. I work at the horse races in Eagle Farm. I manage the stables. Horses are so beautiful, but I'm the one who has to use, euthanize them if they break their ankle. Definitely the worst part of my job. Oh, wow. Cakes, huh? She sounds pretty cool. I love that your brain jumped from imagining an inbred kid with six arms to reminiscing about your life of crime fighting. Were you imagining a kid with flailing arms and thinking he'd be good at jujitsu or remember that time? Holy shit, you work at the races? Do you know Luke? He's such an asshole. Just kidding, he's cool. You have to euthanize them? That's so fucked up. Luke's had to kill blah, 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 (laughs) blah. Yeah, mum has a cake a day. Her sense of taste has increased because her sight is gone. Gross white eyes shooting around the room. It makes me sick. Oh, yeah, that's actually exactly how my thinking went. I thought six arms would definitely come in handy when fighting crime. You could literally toss yourself off while fighting five men off. Yeah, there's two Lukes at work. What's his last name? I think Luke is coming in tomorrow, so I'll ask him about you. Yeah, killing the horses is terrible, especially when the first bullet doesn't do the job. So Matt starts the conversation. Birds piss and shit from the same hole. How was your weekend? They do indeed. It's called their cloaca. My weekend was okay. Working, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> yeah, it's crazy that they have one hole. When roosters have sex with them, it's kind of like doing <laughs> on sex at the same time. <laughs> Little rooster c**ks pumping. My weekend was stallion ass. I planted like four trees. Where are you? No reply. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Little rooster cocks pumping. <laughs> Do roosters have dicks? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Hey. Probably something. Surely. Yeah. Find out. Let's get one over here. Imagine if they had like a human looking dick and little dick and balls. It's got a call no, cocks. I think it's like a little <laughs> triangle. I, mean, I imagine it's a triangle. A red triangle. <laughs> yeah. What the f- <laughs> <laughs> Just stabs into him. <clears throat> That starts with, I'm so stoned I can barely read. Mm, that's fantastic. Oh, I just woke up. There was vomit in my bed with me. I don't even remember. Oh. What's your name? <laughs> and that's an ongoing <laughs> oh, She hasn't written back. <laughs> I get a lot of people ask me, what, does Marty just sit at home tindering all day? Yeah, literally. And I said, Next to my wife. And, yeah, and everyone's yeah. like, what, what does his wife think? And I was like, I think, I'm pretty sure they do it together. Yeah, yeah. Mom, oh, really? just, has, mom just has a read with me. Yeah. <laughs> it's always just... <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> anyway, that, sorry guys for the um, underdeveloped Tinder conversations. There's some good setups for next week though. So next week it's going to be fucking intense. All right. So fucking fucking. And that is Matt's Tinder adventures. You're welcome, man. <laughs> all right. Last week um, we was the Bosley episode. So it came out. So there's no questions on that one. So um, no Q&A this week. No can PO I, box this week. Can I just say one thing about everyone's response to so that? was so beautiful. Yeah, so yeah. Thank, thank you, you guys. So much. I've lovely. never seen so many liked. Com- like every single person's comments were liked by other people. Yeah, we um, nice. we were, we were a bit worried because it's not like funny. So we we're like a bit worried. We can create our own Q and A. What's the closest person you've lost? <laughs> I like thought about it too like, Yeah what? me too I was like fucking hell <laughs> Who's your closest person Matt? It's a risky question I don't yeah. know it's it's it. it can bring up like yeah, If it's been something recent you know. Yeah nothing really, recent Does it have to be a person or like if it's no, like, yeah. no you can be an animal as well Yeah Okay <laughs> I always say the other day It was like a couple months ago Yeah 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 dogs are rough eh Way to fuck our podcast up, Michael. <laughs> yeah. I just wanted to see what happened. <laughs> <laughs> All right, look. All right. Let's let's. Do you have any more questions? <laughs> um, yeah, yeah. Actually, okay. I'll think of something. Um, what about a scenario for the Brown? All right. Okay, so here's the scenario, Brown. You don't see your mum, and this can go for you boys too, for three years, unless. 
for thirty k. So ten k a year, I don't get to see my mom for three years. Yeah, and you, have but you to can always explain to her. You get to go, mom. Look, I'm making thirty k. I'm a little short on cash. Can you just can you can do phone chats? Just don't get to go see her. No, I reckon. Hang on. He see, a lot of people. Make excuses. A lot of people would say yes, yes to this. I reckon. <laughs> a lot of people say yes to this, but. I'm going to say no because you I, love your mommy. I love my mother. You love your mommy? I love my mum and mm-hmm. I, I'm not going <laughs> to deny myself time with my mother for 30K. Okay. Maybe 3 million. Is ours, um, like, do we get 30 each? Get 30 each. Yeah. yeah right. Every 10K a year. Done. <laughs> <laughs> the only awkward parts would be like Christmas and shit because you have to make something up. Oh, yeah, I'm real yeah, sick this year. No, she gets to know what's going on. Now, like, if you were serious about it, I would just, like, travel overseas. Oh yeah, true. You easily get away with it. Yeah, yeah that's true. Yeah. Yeah. Use you know that money to go travel. Well, yeah, out. if she didn't <laughs> know, but if you could explain to her, look, mum, we can just do phone calls. I can't see you, but I get thirty k. Do you understand? I reckon my mum would get that if I was like. <laughs> well, I will say one thing: if I was your age, I'd say yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah it changes true. now. Our mums are quite old. They don't have long left. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Would you? Who's whose mum do you think will die first? Don't fucking say that. <laughs> I just don't want it to be mine Nor do I want it to be yours Okay I got a better question well, Who, We're going to live forever Matt Forever <laughs> Whose mums Who's got the toughest mum I reckon I know for a fact My mum could beat the shit out of your mums <laughs> Your mums are trained Your mum's trained though Isn't she She's I don't, No no Actually maybe your mum could win I reckon she, my mum would bash your mum. Yeah, my mum was just mom tiny. Mum was a tiny little. My mum's got the te- like she can. She's got the hidden temper. Like she, it's, she's like yeah, okay. the brown I reckon Max mum would win in UFC fight. But like, does your mum smoke meth at funerals? She giggles a lot. She giggles a lot. <laughs> <laughs> All our mums look so like innocent. Like they wouldn't do that though. So yeah, I know. I don't but know. if you just oh, sort your mum kind of looks like she fights. Yeah, fuck. She's probably fucked a few people up. <laughs> but, yeah. You're gonna say fucked a few. Probably fucked a few people. <laughs> like yourself. <laughs> oh, <laughs> what? Dad's, I reckon, I don't know, mate. Yeah, dad's is hard. Oh, um, my dad's better than your dad. Are you going to do that one? That's like our whole fucking bucks. <laughs> my whole bucks was just us saying whose dad would win in a fight. That was like an hour conversation. Once again, isn't your dad trained? Yeah, I reckon my dad's pretty tough. I've Ju- that. Julian reckons his dad would be beat the shit out of everyone's dad. He's got a temper. I've heard it what on the phone. About your dad, yeah, I don't think Greg would go well in a fight. Greg, Greg um, is a bit trained, but he's he's such a, a trained. Nice. He's too nice. He's trained? trained karate for years, but um, oh wow, yeah. of course he does <laughs> karate. Yeah. But um, hands like that, of course. <laughs> but nah, he's he's such a nice dude. He'd try and be like, hey, let's not fight. Come on. Yeah. Okay. What about we your dad? Would your dad? Bash, do you reckon your dad's tough? Oh, he used to flog us back in the day heaps. Yeah. <laughs> like, he's got a lot of rage built up, and if you let go of it all, I reckon yeah. he would eliminate someone. He gets pretty angry. <laughs> <laughs> Delete someone. He's oh. always oh, that sounds like Julian's dad. Yeah. Dad. yeah. yeah. <laughs> he always say, shut up and shut up. <laughs> double up shut on Shut up and shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Just doubles up on <laughs> 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 Fuck off and fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well. As soon as the second one came in, you were done. With <laughs> you little <laughs> asshole, asshole. <laughs> uh, uh, that was a spectacle. I still remember to this day. Still scares me. Everything's doubled up. <laughs> oh, man, I actually like it. I think it works. <laughs> oh. did, did he ever hit one of you, but it was the other's fault? Oh. Like, did you ever blame your no, brother? I think for something? we were pretty quick to be like, it was that kind yeah. of yeah. thing. <laughs> <laughs> we always throw each other, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Uh, oh wow blah, blah. So I remember we up on that big waterfall Up was we travelled Oz when we were younger Like pretty lucky with our whole family yeah. But Tom was being a sh- fucking wanker this day And dad up top of the waterfall And dad was throwing shoes at him <laughs> And then started belting him And like, everyone was there It was, was like, it was like tourists everyone. everywhere <laughs> right? oh, oh, think, Bam oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, had, he was throwing the shoes out And then he just came out yeah, and oh, like, oh. But doesn't he only have so two good. Like how did he pull other shoes out <laughs> No he threw two And then he came out He always doubles up yeah. Right? Yeah. 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 Shut up and Shut up <laughs> <laughs> He's got oh. four pairs of shoes yeah, Instead exactly. of two yeah. Yeah. I love what? hearing stories two. Of how like parents have beat you It's so good <laughs> Oh man yeah, I was lucky I only got like a smack here or there can you still do that? Even things? after you shat no. on the walls, you didn't get belted. I didn't really shit on walls. I think when I was a kid. Yeah, it was, was only when he, when he started oh, okay. drinking that. that started <laughs> oh, fuck, smoking. 
Yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's meth came, man. <laughs> yeah, fuck. No, I yeah. like it's fucking done. I was pretty good. Yeah, yeah. It pays off, I reckon, eh? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I reckon A lot of people do say that. Yeah, yeah I reckon yeah. I'll hit my kid pretty hard. Yeah. If it's, <laughs> if it's a boy, you can definitely <laughs> have a one fucking... One's my help. <laughs> 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 you got to double up. I'm definitely throwing <laughs> shoes. That yeah. sounds like fun. <laughs> <laughs> a thong here and there, Adam. <laughs> One's out of your hands and their control. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. They They've got to be good at dodging. Yeah, got, yeah. <laughs> You're hitting them, it's different, but. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, All right. yeah. No more questions? Any questions, boys? Um, well, I was going to say earlier, but it was kind of fucking in the point. I wanted to ask you if you if one of their, um, if you could kill one of their parents, which one would you kill first? <laughs> if one had to be killed. Which, Wait, if I could know. kill one of their no, no, parents. No, 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 if you called it, if you had to kill one of their parents, which one would you kill? Oh, that's so hard. <laughs> Because I've I've met Marty's mother and she's so beautiful. Um, you haven't met mine, and I haven't met your mom. Oh, wow! So I guess. My but I but I'm looking in Michael's eyes right now. It's so hard to say I'm gonna kill you. Just your kill mom. my oh, dad. Man. I'd go, if I hadn't met your mom, but I'd met him, I'd have to kill. Oh, him. Make it all parents. Vice versa. You gotta, you gotta kill, you gotta kill both, okay. and you have to kill him by punching them to death. <laughs> oh, oh fuck! I don't want to do either. <laughs> I don't want to do either, but I just have to say I have to kill yours only because I've met your mum. Yeah, that's that's fair. the only way. I, it's like mum or dad. But, oh, isn't it both? <laughs> you say both. Well, which one? Just one. You can do you both if you want. Then I go. You first afterwards. <laughs> then I go. I'd kill. Actually, no. I kill Marty's dad. Yeah. I kill Marty's dad. All right. Done. <laughs> Easy. Yeah, because I've seen um, pictures of your parents and I've never seen a picture of your dad. Mm. All right, so the and I can't picture him, okay. so it's going to be my. Well, dad. fuck, I win. I came out okay carrying that one. There you go. <laughs> and we all did. <laughs> 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 oh fuck! All right, let's fucking do a prank call now. Funny, how can I help? Hello, darling. My name is Rhonda. Okay, and my husband came into our establishment last week to purchase a, a ladder from you guys, okay? And yesterday he was using the ladder okay? And it's folded in half leading him to fall okay? I had to rush him to the hospital and we get the scans back today and so that he's got three ruptured discs in his back and a cracked lung, okay? So I'm just calling you guys to let you know that you're selling faulty equipment to my husband. So we're going to have to take this further down because that's not acceptable. Excuse me. Hello? Yeah, okay, so what would you like me to do? Well, you need to let m management know, okay, that we will be pressing charges, okay. My uncle is studying to do lawyer, and we're going to have to take things further, darling. Excuse me. I need to talk to your manager, darling, and that's probably scary. What I'm saying, but you need to put your management on down because the damage is done, I'm afraid. <laughs> put me on hold, you bitch. <laughs> Fucking put me on hold. Hello? Hey, Mrs. Lee. Hello? Good afternoon, Mrs. Lee. Who am I speaking with, sir? Lee? Can I help you? Yes, darling. I was just saying to your staff member, okay, my husband bought a ladder from your establishment yesterday, okay, and it broke while he was using it, okay. I rushed him to hospital, okay. I was having a glass of Shiraz with girls, had to stop rush him to the hospital and th today we see the scans and he's got three ruptured discs and a cracked lung okay so I was just calling to let you guys know that we're gonna have to take this 
further with legal and my uncle is going to be pressing charges against your establishment for selling faulty ladders, darling. You can't do that to people. You could hurt them. Excuse me. Okay. Thanks very much for your phone call. So if you just want to put that in an email and I can pass it on to the people you need to know. Well, darling, you don't make the demands. Okay, I'm letting you know that you establishment stole a faulty ladder, darling. You can't be stole a faulty ladder and expect people not to separate charges. Excuse me. Do you understand, darling? So I'm not sending email female nitty diddly diddly. Okay, we will be sending you a letter pressing charges because your letter has fault, you, faulty. Okay, and my Your husband and now letter. has cr- cracked, cracked back. Oh, <laughs> oh, dude. I fucking love Rhonda. <laughs> dearly, so dearly. Oh, fuck. Love Hello, did you say sending in a letter yeah, instead of a letter? letter. <laughs> oh, it was like a letter. You need, yeah, it, it's so, man, it's hard. You're going to find that personality that will bite back. Well, man, yeah, they did not a... want a bar of us. They're like, yeah, yeah send an email. And she's like, no, nah, thank you for your call. But oh, man, it's hard to create a conflict when there's an easy way out for them. Yeah. But anyway, fuck it. We'll be more organized next week. I still enjoy it, Ronda. <sighs> All right, guys. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and give us a five-star review on Spotify. All right, and thank you very much to the Reese bros for coming in. Thank you, them. boys. Give them a fucking watch. And we'll see you slags next week because we are, are the, the best. best. We're the best. We're the best. We're the fucking best. We're the 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 fucking best. Fuck.